When a wind turbine is too close to a populated area, it's the same as any source of continuous noise that is too loud for where people live. It affects sleep and it affects quality of life. And if sleep is affected chronically, you have a uh, fairly high risk or a high probability of serious chronic health issues. So this is the, this is the most pressing uh, issue. The, uh, the secondary issue is the effect on mental health. There is a clear and unequivocal effect on mental health. People end up with, with more prescription medication use uh, when they're exposed to these things chronically. I have, uh, uh, somebody told me that you have, uh, have made a study and uh, today, by pure coincidence, it has been uh, approved? It, has been, it was published today. Published. Yes, the study was accepted for publication some months ago and it's uh, been prepared for publication. It was finally released today. It was, it was uh, published online just this morning. What, what, what does this study tell us? So the study basically tells you what I just told you which is that uh, w wind turbines uh, placed within 1400 meters of a population will result in very significant adverse health effects in a significant proportion of the population. There has been a lot of discussions about where to place a, a wind turbine. What in your concept, Dr. Nissenbaum, would be a perfect place to place the wind turbines? It really depends on the size of the turbines. So, for example, in Mars Hill and Vinyl Haven, Maine, these turbines were 1.5 megawatt size. The rotor diameter was 80 meters. Okay? And we know beyond, beyond any doubt that within 1.5 kilometers, within 1,500 meters, there are significant adverse health effects. The uh, turbines that are being proposed here for Urirama will, are 3 megawatt turbines. They have a rotor diameter of 120 meters. We know it's a fact of life that these uh, turbines will put out more sound energy, more noise, with more low frequency energy than the 1.5 megawatt turbines at Mars Hill. So if Mars Hill is dangerous at 1.5 kilometers, these turbines here are dangerous at something more than 1.5 kilometers. I don't know what that is exactly, but it is definitely more than 1.5 kilometers.